Good morning students. This is my session 12th standard chapter 4 inverse trigonometric functions properties of inverse trigonometric functions. Before seeing the properties of inverse trigonometric functions first recall the trigonometric functions. What are trigonometric ratios? Yes sin theta, cos theta, tan theta, cosecant theta, secant theta and cot theta. This is sin x cos x and kuda solalam anga x and represent pannirundanga adu x nu eduthukonu theta and represent pannirundanga angles theta nu eduthukonu next we are going to see the coangles coangle of sin theta is equal to cos theta that is cos sin sin oda coangle enna appadina cosin da cosin da coangle that only represented as cos that is co angle of cos theta means in the co remove panito apina that is cosine la co remove panitona sin. So that is the co angle of cos theta. Co angle of tan theta that is co angle of tangent is cotangent that is cot theta. Similarly, co angle of cot theta is in the co remove panitona tangent karigo that is tan theta. Co angle of cosecant theta. C1 is the co-angle. So, cosecant theta is the co-angle. Secant theta is the co-angle. Cosecant theta. Next, we are going to see the reciprocal functions. That is, sin theta equal to 1 by cosecant theta. Similarly, in the cosecant theta, in the sin theta is That is, cosecant theta equal to 1 by sin theta. Next one is cos theta equal to 1 by secant theta. Secant theta equal to 1 by cos theta. Tan theta equal to 1 by cot theta. Cot theta equal to 1 by tan theta. These are called the reciprocal functions. Next already we are known this formula. Tan theta equal to sin theta by cos theta. And cot theta equal to the reciprocal of tan theta. That is cos theta divided by sin theta. These are the basic trigonometric formulae. Let us see the property 1. Before seeing this property, I have to just recall the range of the inverse functions. For sin inverse, the range is closed interval minus pi by 2 comma pi by 2. For cos inverse, closed interval 0 to pi. For tan inverse, open interval minus pi by 2 comma pi by 2. For cosecant inverse, closed interval minus pi by 2 comma pi by 2 except 0. For secant inverse, the range is closed interval 0 to pi except pi by 2. For cot inverse, open interval 0 to pi. Let us see the first one. Sin inverse of sin theta equal to, the sin inverse and the sin will get cancelled. We will get the theta. This theta value must be lies within this range. That is, theta belongs to closed interval minus pi by 2 comma pi by 2. For the cos inverse of cos theta, cos inverse and cos cancellation of theta and karikum, this theta value must be belongs to this range. Closed interval 0 to pi. For the third one, tan inverse of tan theta equal to tan inverse and tan and cancel it theta and karikum. The range of the tan inverse is open interval minus pi by 2 comma pi by 2. Fourth one is cosecant inverse of cosecant theta equal to theta. We will get this theta must be lies between closed interval minus pi by 2 comma pi by 2 except 0. Fifth one is secant inverse of secant theta equal to secant inverse of secant of cancel it theta and karikum. This theta must be belongs to closed interval 0 to pi except pi by 2. Sixth one is cot inverse of cot theta equal to theta. That cot inverse range is open interval 0 to pi. So this theta value must be lies between open interval 0 to pi. Next we are going to see the properties 2. Before that you have to just recall the trigonometric functions and its range. For sine and cosine, its range is closed interval minus 1 comma 1. For tangent and cotangent, its range is all real numbers. For cosecant and secant, 
the real number is that open interval minus 1 comma 1. So see this first one sin of sin inverse of x is equal to x. This sin of sin inverse cancel on x and kadegu. The range must be sin function order range other. That is x must be belongs to closed interval minus 1 comma 1. Similarly for the cos also that is cos of cos inverse of x equal to cancel it x and kadegu. That x must be belongs to closed interval minus 1 comma 1. Next one is tan of tan inverse of x. Here the x must be belongs to all real numbers. Fourth one is cosecant of cosecant inverse of x equal to x. If x belongs to all real numbers except open interval minus 1 comma 1. Similarly for the secant also the x must be lies between real numbers except open interval minus 1 comma 1. Then for that cot of cot inverse of x, the x must be belongs to all real numbers. Next to property 3, reciprocal inverse identities. First one, sin inverse of 1 by x is equal to sin order reciprocal in cosecant. So sin inverse is cosecant inverse, 1 by x order reciprocal in x. So for sin inverse of 1 by x, we will get cosecant inverse of x. If x must be belongs to all real numbers except to open interval minus 1 comma 1. Similarly, for cos inverse of 1 by x, we will get cos order inverse function in anna secant. So, cos inverse on the secant inverse nal 1 by x the x nal If x must be belongs to all real numbers except to open interval minus 1 comma 1. The last one is for tan inverse of 1 by x, for tan in tan order reciprocal in abdina cot. So tan inverse cot inverse nal 1 by x order reciprocal x nal if x value greater than 0. That is ingerkara x value and the positive number arnadana, we can directly write cot inverse of x. Suppose if it is less than 0 mean, that is negative mean, we have to write this tan inverse of 1 by x as minus pi plus cot inverse of x. Now see the property for reflection identities. First one, sin inverse of minus x is equal to, in the minus front la ondru, minus sin inverse of x. If x belongs to closed interval minus 1 comma 1. Second one is tan inverse of minus x is equal to in the front la minus on the chana, minus tan inverse of x if x belongs to r that is the domain of this x are given here third one is cosecant inverse of minus x equal to minus front la on the one minus cosecant inverse of x if modulus of x greater than or equal to 1 or x belongs to all real numbers except open interval minus 1 comma 1 the next one is cos inverse of minus x is equal to that is cos lambda pi minus cos inverse of x and so that is 180 degree minus second quadrant represent if x belongs to closed interval minus 1 comma 1 that is the domain of this cos inverse function. Fifth one is secant inverse of minus x is equal to pi minus secant inverse of x. If modulus of x greater than or equal to 1 or x belongs to real numbers except open interval minus 1 comma 1. The last one is cot inverse of minus x is equal to pi minus cot inverse of x if x belongs to real numbers. See sin inverse tan inverse cosecant inverse and in the minus direct of front la la. cos inverse secant inverse cot inverse. In the moon functions, ko, pi minus in solely ported for this reflection identities. Next, we are going to see property 5 co function inverse identities. Co functions na erkne padicho sin order co angle and cosine, cosine order co angle sin, and tangent order co angle co tangent that is cot, cot order co angle tangent that is tan theta. Then for cosecant. Secant is the co-function. For secant, cosecant is the co-function. 
let us see this first one sin inverse of x plus cos inverse of x is equal to 5 by 2 for all x belongs to the closed interval minus 1 comma 1 this is the domain of sin inverse and cos inverse function second one is tan inverse of x plus cot inverse of x is equal to pi by 2 for all x belongs to real number the third identity is cosecant inverse of x plus secant inverse of x is equal to pi by 2 for all x belongs to r except open interval minus 1 comma 1 or modulus of x greater than or equal to 1 so or inverse function o adoda co function the inverse function o irundadu abadina sum of the two terms is always pi by 2 adu da in the property Next, we are going to see the property 6, how to memorize these identities. First one is sin inverse of x plus sin inverse of y equal to sin inverse of x into square root of 1 minus y square plus y into square root of 1 minus x square where either x square plus y square less than or equal to 1 or x y less than 0. So, sin inverse of x plus sin inverse of y abdina in an arcuda plus varum x into square root of 1 minus y square in a y into square root of 1 minus x square. Ide the next identity in abdina sin inverse of x minus sin inverse of y abdina sin inverse of x into square root of 1 minus y square in a plus put at the minus minus put minus y into square root of 1 minus x square so in the middle of the term what is the plus one the plus one minus one the minus one let us see the third identity cos inverse of x plus cos inverse of y equal to cos inverse of x y minus square root of 1 minus x square into 1 minus y square if x plus y greater than or equal to 0 so, in the plus one the in the terms the minus one the room. It is in a straight identity in the minus one the in the term matuna plus and maritu. That is cos inverse of x minus cos inverse of y equal to cos inverse of xy plus square root of 1 minus x square into square root of 1 minus y square. Next one is tan inverse of x plus tan inverse of y is equal to tan inverse of in the plus and rekanala, mela x plus y divided by numerator la plus na denominator la minus 1. 1 minus xy if xy less than 1. This is the next one la in the minus one the in the minus na in the mela minus one the denominator la plus one the That is tan inverse of x minus tan inverse of y equal to tan inverse of x minus y divided by 1 plus xy if xy greater than minus 1. Next we are going to see the property 7. So, we have to see property the first property of proof on the book. How to just go through that. We have to see the properties of the first proof of the first proof. We have to see properties of the first proof. So, in the prop, if we have to see the seventh property, Number last year, 11th, the double angle, triple angle, so on the formula sa base panne, prove panne panne. Let us see the first one. 2 tan inverse of x equal to tan inverse of 2x divided by 1 minus x square for all modulus of x less than 1. For 2, in, two tan inverse of x is equal to, if the tan inverse lay the no, 2x divided by 1 minus x square nerdu no. In the tan inverse, cos inverse the formula is 1 minus x square divided by 1 plus x square for all x greater than or equal to 0. The last one is 2 tan inverse of x equal to sin inverse the model, sin inverse of 2x divided by 1 plus x square for all modulus of x less than or equal to 1. So in the moon may when the for one of the property then that is 2 into tan inverse of x to the answers are the tan inverse of when on and when the identity use panic no cos inverse la when on in the identity use panic no sin inverse la when on in the identity use panic next we are going to see the property 8 
first one is sin inverse of 2x into square root of 1 minus x square is equal to 2 into sin inverse of x if modulus of x less than or equal to 1 by root 2 or minus 1 by root 2 less than or equal to x less than or equal to 1 by root 2. This is one of the important property. The next property is also sin inverse of 2x into square root of 1 minus x square. But the answer is depends upon the x values. If x is lies between minus 1 by root 2 to 1 by root 2 means you have to use 2 sin inverse of x. If x value is lies between 1 by root 2 to 1 means you have to use 2 cos inverse of x. That is if 1 by root 2 less than or equal to x less than or equal to 1. Next we are going to see property 9. Sin inverse of x equal to cos inverse of square root of 1 minus x square. If 0 less than or equal to x less than or equal to 1. That is x value must be belongs to closed interval 0 to 1. At that time you have to use this property. Next one is sin inverse of x equal to minus cos inverse of square root of 1 minus x square. If minus 1 less than or equal to x less than 0. That is for negative values you have to use this identity. For that next one, sin inverse of x is equal to tan inverse of x divided by square root of 1 minus x square if minus 1 less than x less than 1. That is x must be belongs to open interval minus 2 minus 1 to 1 at the time you have to use this property. Next one is cos inverse of x equal to sin inverse of square root of 1 minus x square if 0 less than or equal to x less than or equal to 1. That is x belongs to closed interval 0 to 1. Next one is cos inverse of x equal to pi minus sin inverse of square root of 1 minus x square if minus 1 less than or equal to x less than 0. That is x value negative or how to use this property. The last one is tan inverse of x is equal to sin inverse of x divided by square root of 1 plus x square is equal to cos inverse of 1 by square root of 1 plus x square if x greater than 0. So x or a value greater than 0 that is positive values are in the tan inverse plus sin inverse la venu na in the values use panikla cos inverse la subtract pananu na how to use this property. The last property is 10th property. First one 3 into sin inverse of x equal to sin inverse of 3x minus 4x cube. For all x belongs to closed interval minus 1 by 2 comma 1 by 2. So in the law on the epi proof panil panga pinna x equala the 3a formula use panni. Last year triple form triple angle formula per chola and the formulas use panni in the, the proof panil panga. How to just to go through that. Similarly, how to prove the second also. See that second one. 3 into cos inverse of x equal to cos inverse of 4x cube minus 3x. For all x belongs to closed interval 1 by 2 comma 1. Thank you students.